Tonight's opera takes place in a swanky bar on Wall Street. It begins a few years ago, before things really began to boom. Two ambitious young bankers are sitting next to each other at the bar. And they get talking, and at first it's all business. A few drinks from now, their talk will naturally turn to true love. Well, to the thing they both truly love, how to dominate the financial world. Let's all belly up to the bar and watch these two young bankers impress each other. I say only big banks are robust. A bank that's small gets ground to dust. To survive, a small bank must adjust. Must. Or else go bust. I say small bank bankers all lack lust. They all think small, they all get fussed. If you want to join the upper crust, why then they must get their hair must. You say think big, they get nonplussed. They call you pig, they, they are, are disgusting. Banks need bigger banks to adulate. Firms that start small then dominate. Titans of finance make their own fate. They do not wait, they innovate. Don't give an inch. Like Merrill Lynch, don't pay much tax like, like Goldman, Goldman Sachs. Sachs. <laughs> Lehman Brothers, that's my kind of bank. It's not small, though it's got swank. It made all their bankers walk the plank. And their bank sank, went down the tank. You see, too. It's the people. Oh, it's really all about, about the, the people. people. I don't want to know about their birth, just their cash flow and net worth. If you took the country of Iceland, which is quite small, oh, it's slightly bland, and gave all its bankers a free hand, they'd prosper and be rich and tanned. New bankers dare to make new rules and to prepare new banking tools. Some special purpose high-yield instrument but overall, I'm confident. Be the special thing that we all went. And slightly bent. Risk, debt, and complexity. Look in my eyes, that's what you see. Let's go and hawk and buy some stock in Northern Rock.
Ben Sears, Brandon Grimmett.